as the Call of Duty Black Ops 6 early access beta comes to an end, figured I'd drop a video, give you guys some gameplay. If you guys haven't watched any yet, or if you just support this channel and you want to know my, you know, pros and cons, I'm not going to get too in depth with it because it's a beta. But I think this game has a lot of potential and I did have a lot of fun. It's really refreshing to get on these new games every every year they're coming out with Call of Duties. And I feel like when you play the beta and you kind of get a sense of what, you know, Call of Duty is thinking of doing or is doing, I think it's great. And with this game, I see a lot of potential. Obviously, there's things that I feel need to be addressed, um, such as vis visibility. I feel like it's hard to see enemies on certain maps and definitely is kind of frustrating when you don't see people and obviously die to them. That's pretty irritating. Um, I feel like the hit registration... Definitely needs to be fixed a little bit. Obviously, it's a beta. There's probably a lot of people on there. Connection is probably not too good. The servers are known to be not very well in betas. Um, but the registration, I feel like, has been kind of trash. Um, Long-range gunfights, I feel like Call of Duty doesn't really focus on those anymore. And it's not very rewarding to sit there and kind of battle somebody, you know, from across the map like it used to be in Call of Duties. But we're also going back to the OG Gunsmith and also the OG Prestige system, which I like a lot because I just, I enjoy feeling rewarded when I'm doing good or leveling up guns or grinding for max prestige and kind of, you know, it, it makes you feel fulfilled. And it's kind of something that made me enjoy Call of Duty as a kid. And it kind of brings that kid out of me, I guess, when you're seeing medals pop up across your screen and you're leveling up and you got the music playing while you're leveling up. And it's kind of just like, an all-around good feeling, if that makes sense. So I'm glad that we're kind of going back to the simple ways of things because sometimes simpler is better, and I'm a firm believer in that. And definitely in Call of Duty, I feel like they've gotten away from that in the past few years. And also with the gunsmith, we don't have 200 different attachments that you can put on your guns, and I feel like, you know, only certain attachments really get used on every single gun, you know, like for the, for the underbarrels in Modern Warfare 3, for example, you got... 30 to 40 different underbarrels you can put on it. But really, you're using the DR6 hand stop, the X10 Phantom 5, or now the Paracord grip. You know, maybe you throw uh, uh, f tac 98, whatever that hand stop is. Sometimes you use that, but it's like, it's just too much, you know what I mean? And I feel like, like I said, simpler is better. We just need to go back to what COD is kind of known for, being a basic FPS shooter game. But Anyway, those are kind of my pros and cons. Um, also, weapon balancing has been pretty good. I feel like you can use just about any weapon in this game. And you're going to do pretty decent with it, which I feel like has been lacking the past few years. Um, I feel like, you know, Modern Warfare 3 especially, you run into like the same three or four weapons every single game. And a lot of times you're running into like four, five, six stacks using the same gun. And it's just kind of frustrating and kind of repetitive, you know what I mean? And it's nice to see... People actually using different weapons and them actually being pretty good with them also because like you know when I see somebody kill me with a weapon that's not meta in Modern Warfare 3 I'm like respect to that dude I can't even be mad this guy's using you know a freaking MX-9 or whatever the case is but you get what I'm saying but anyway I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and if you do drop a like and if you want to see more Black Ops 6 content coming soon hit that subscribe button obviously between now and next weekend you'll probably see one or two Modern Warfare 3 videos and Obviously, until this game comes out, you'll see Modern Warfare 3, as always. But anyway, enjoy the video. Drop a like. Hit that subscribe button. Hope you guys enjoy. Much love to you guys. Peace. His name is I Love Children, a weirdo.
I love this shotgun. Mark with the shoddy. a syntax.
Oh, damn. Back on some skyline. There's somebody up there. Oh, I got stems on this class. That's your dumb ass. Boy. Ah. Uh. Reload the blicky. I know they're gonna be back here. Not a single shot. Alright, city guns. I'm gonna need you to turn that shit the fuck off. Terrible ass mic. What are you doing? <laughs> what in the world? I heard him too. Oh. I just got slammed. Not gonna lie. I just got fucking hurricane rounded. Six one nine off the top rope. The fact that all right. got nothing to say. Stupid. Where am I going? Where am I going? <laughs> What? Landed first shot and everything on that guy. First kill with the pistol of the year? First kill with the pistol of the year? What? English?
Owie, wowie. Another one there. I was about to get gunned down with the pistol. How did I die out of that? Mmm, that was like the first long range gunfight that I like really felt very confident. And the outcome was actually pretty promising. <clears throat> Lose it, Dev. Done on these fools. Done on these fools. 